is over and now the big day is here it's the final of the uefa europa league i'm derek ray and as always on these big occasions i'm joined for commentary by the former arsenal and england defender stuart robson we're on the cusp of kickoff it's eintracht frankfurt against victoria pilsen well derek this has everything doesn't it two good teams some top class players and a couple of excellent coaches what a final this should be and the starting 11 for Eintracht Frankfurt. Well, it looks like they're going to play in a 3-4-3 formation, but without wing-backs. So although they might have an overload in midfield, they will be vulnerable to any switches of play by the opposition. This is what they'll be facing today. Well, it's a 3-4. Oh, Stewart, they've got to score! Simple save, really. by the keeper might give them a chance and well, the referee allowing the play to flow well Mario Kutze so often a player for big and special moments Stewart what do you expect we'll see from him in this game well it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player he can go oh past... hang on Stewart big chance here and the keeper there to deal with it Favouring the short one. Good uh, moving infield. Oh, a smart stop. It's one corner after another. So the corner played into the box. Well, full marks to him for that header, but the goalkeeper did his job. Behind for another corner. Can they cash in? Short corner favourite. Whips it came right off the touchline. Oh, that surely had to go in, but marvellous defending. Lukas Kalbach. This looks more than decent. Able to close down the shot. Frankfurt have controlled the possession in the last 15 minutes. You sense it's inevitable the goal will come. It'll be certainly no less than they deserve. They just need to be a bit more clinical in that final third now. It looks promising. And there the move ends for now. Tomasz Kory. Chance to do damage. And possibilities inside the box. Not all that hard to deal with crosses like that. Did really well to get through. Oh, in with a chance! Not to be for him. He went for power over placement. Well, you're right. He decided to go for the power, which in the end he couldn't control. He'll be furious with himself. That's a big miss. Plenty of support here. But well, he's got past his man. No problems for the keeper.
Tomas Hori. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. And with that, the first half draws to a close. It is the Europa League final, and they are underway. And the keeper there to deal with it. Gutze moving infield. Oh, a smart stop. It's one corner after another. for that header but the goalkeeper did his job behind for another corner can they oh in with a chance not to be for him he went for power over placement well you're right he decided to go for the power which in the end he couldn't control So back underway here into the second half. And he's made headway. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Who's going to get on the end of it? Outrageously good piece of defending on the line. Well, no danger now. Possession one. Can he find the right pass? And that's easy peasy for the keeper. Niels and Kunku. Mario Götze. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Oh, he's lost possession. Can they forge ahead? Oh, there's the goal! There's the opener! How about that? You have to ask, where's the defending? The keeper is completely exposed, but he still had to finish it, and he did it really well. It's a good goal. Back underway, 1-0 it is. Ansgar Knauf. Promising sequence. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. use of advantage there the fans want to see a shot and fine goalkeeping good refereeing waiting for a natural break before administering the caution so a personnel change then
taken short. Oh no, not even close to hitting the target that time. From one flag to the other, but overhit. Well, Frankfurt have controlled the possession in the last 15 minutes, and they certainly deserve their lead. Another one here, and that will put the game beyond doubt. Just cutting off the supply. Giving it their all in search of an equaliser. And blocked for now. Well, a good place to win it, but and a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? Well, you have to conclude, Stuart, an opportunity wasted. Yeah, and the other players are furious with it, and rightly so. That's such a poor free kick. Mario Goodson. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. And they're making a change. And we've entered the final five minutes. Robin Koch. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. And they're trying to get right into his face. And there's the whistle. This UEFA Europa League final has been decided. And my goodness, they deserve it. Disappointment on one side, but sheer jubilation on the other. Well, relief and joy, I would say. What a great achievement this is, and so well deserved, as you mentioned. They were excellent tonight. What a good performance that was. The party can certainly start now. That's a party to last throughout the year, I should think. to be celebrating good times in the Europa League and now the trophy awaits them well these are always great moments for any player this is the culmination of a great tournament they've had they fully deserve this victory every player played his part tonight this is what they've wanted now it's in their possession <laughs> 